Call. This is what they call is that you're trying to call bottoms when price is moving down that you're saying okay we've reached the bottom without price forming a bullish candle or it's called calling tops that when price is moving up right and you're saying that okay we've reached the top area yes, so now we're going to sell right over here when all candles are bullish so you have to have to wait for candles to form um, to form bears or bullish like whatever you want right you have to wait for candles to form in your direction so that you can say okay now I have some sort of confirmation that candles are going to move my way make sense so just don't take opposite trades when the candles are moving like it's it it looks good that you had a wick entry but it's not going to happen often Right? It looks good for Instagram. It looks really good, but it's not going to happen often. Trust me. All right. What do we have here? Always look for potential areas of destination. Yep. Exactly. So, so this means is that when you have price moving down, right, and you're looking at a support to the left, so that's your destination, right? This means that once price is moving down, now you have the opportunity to maybe take a trade till that support because think about it right now there's someone out there who is trying to take buys when price is moving down so more often than not those buys are going to get stopped out because the momentum excuse me because the momentum is bearish and we're moving down right so when you're looking to see that okay wait a minute so we're, if, if we're moving down and there's a support over here and there's strong bearish momentum we are in New York and London overlap. There's a high chance that price is going to continue down to the support, right? So what do you do? You jump to the smaller time frames and you start to see that, okay, now when price is moving down, it's probably going to do something like this and then start to move down. So you're looking for many resistances to be formed, maybe on the 30 minute or 15 minutes to see that, okay, now it's like, you know, you can say that, okay, maybe a resistance is being formed somewhere over here and then you can say that okay now we can probably have a stop above this area because the trend is bearish and we're selling resistance in a bearish market so there's a high chance that price is going to come down to this support makes sense so that's what you say okay now we're trying to create trend because in the in the opposite spectrum if you're trying to take buys man you're just constantly trending right here when there's no confirmation right so always look at it this way and in the opposite way when price is moving up and you look left to see that okay there is some sort of a resistance here and this is where price starts moving up so there's a higher chance that price is going to continue moving up and you look for the same things to happen right sometimes price is going to do something like this and will move up right so if you are not looking for confirmations you're going to look at this area and say okay 
Now we're consolidating, so we're going to move down. 